Good morning, hunties. Woo! I had an amazing sleep last night, praise God. I'm about to go on the road. I'm getting a chemical peel. We'll talk about that when we get to the esthetician office. Esthetician. But um, I'm getting a chemical peel. Obviously, it removes like the dead skin off of your face. It reduces fine lines, wrinkles, dark spots, scars. And have you guys ever got a chemical peel? Comment below. I'm kind of nervous because I've heard of horror stories where some women got burned and it burned their face and that's like kind of scary to me and I don't want that to happen to me. My mom has these shoes and I'm thinking about wearing them. <laughs> what do y'all think? Why does my mom love her cowboy boots? She be rolling through these shoes in her cowboy boots, okay? She wore her little skirt to her cowboy boots. It's so funny to me. She has her socks in the cowboy boots. They're on my heels right now. Should I wear them? I think they match. Like, you know, brown bag, have a little maroon, little two-piece on with my cowboy boots. <laughs> Yeehaw! Let's go. Let's go. We're gonna be late. <laughs> Okay, okay, I'm going. Don't be scared. So my skin is gonna peel off of my skin? Yeah, you'll, it's, it's, you're gonna peel. You are gonna peel, so that first layer is gonna fold up and it's gonna come to your skin. It's like, kind of like shedding. Like, like so, does it, will it remove like dark marks yes, and like smooth out? Lightening, skin? yeah. Like, the hyperpigmentation app, yeah. Why is it $850? Because it works. <laughs> 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 All right, he's going to be in shortly. Let me know if you need anything. Okay, okay, thank you. You're welcome. $850. <laughs> Thank you. One of my girls, Indy, you guys haven't met her before. I actually vlogged with her, but I didn't post the content. So anyways, you guys will meet her. She just got a chemical peel and her skin is looking so good. Her results are phenomenal. It's so smooth, you know, her skin's glowing. I'm like, what the heck? Like, I'm trying to get a chemical peel. And so she told me to come to pour. P-O-R-E, star, and they're based out here in Atlanta. They have like over 100K um, followers. They're well known. There's so many girls who go here and their skin looks so amazing. Like, first of all, look at her results. I've noticed that when I scar, like I cut myself, I bruise myself, whatever happens, or if I have like a pimple and I pick it or something, it leaves dark marks. I remember growing up, I had all these scars on my legs. My skin scars easily. When the scar heals, it turns dark. It doesn't even, it doesn't matter. It just turns dark. So anyways, if you struggle with that problem, what do you do, what creams do you use? Let me know in the comments below because I'm really trying to find, you know, some products that work. Okay, so I'm getting a chemical peel and I'm kind of nervous because I haven't done this before. My girl, Indy, she recommended that I come to Charette Cosmetics and see Paul here. First of all, he's three months booked up in advance. A little booked, a little booked up, but booked. we got you in. Booked and busy, and he got yeah. me in, so thank you so much. So I was going through the Instagram page, and first of all, you have like over 100,000. Right. So obviously, like, you stamped your mark in the industry. Right. And a lot of people, they go to you, and I've seen so many like before and after photos, and you kill it. Well, thank you. We created this peel, the one that we're actually going to do on you today. It's called the Melanex peel, and it works really good. One, for all skin types, but it works really well for darker skin types. So, you know, there's a lack of treatments for people of color, whether you're Indian, you're Asian, you're Black, you're Spanish. So, here we made this peel that works really, really well for people with darker skin that have been searching for treatments to help correct their skin. They've been to dermatologists, doctors, med spas, tried everything, and nothing's able to work. 
So, you know, people are really loving this peel because they're getting results that they've never seen before right. with any other treatment. Right. Why do you think darker skin tones scar so easily and then it takes like years to remove the scar? Darker skin has a lot more melanin in it, right? right. So melanin is the color. Um, so, you know, you're more prone to what's called PIH, post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation. So anytime there's any type of irritation or, you know, <clears throat> if you get like a bump, right, or a mm -hmm. pimple, mm -hmm. uh, that's kind of, and it leaves a mark, yep. you're more prone to PIH versus someone with less melanin in their skin. Right. So that's why, you know, that pigmentation can kind of hang around longer. Mm -hmm. But the good thing is we have treatments where we can lift and peel and remove that pigmentation out of the skin. Right, do you also have like creams that we can also use? A thousand percent. Okay, and yeah. that will remove those dark Well, marks. yeah, creams can. Now, creams obviously take longer right. than something like a treatment. Yeah. So like, you know, if something you're wanting faster results, you're gonna wanna do more of a treatment, mm -hmm. which is a little bit more aggressive, you know, but over time you can use, there are products that can remove it. It just takes longer. Okay, so Leah is numbing me right now. And she told me that she's a hunty. I'm a hunty. She's a hunty. <laughs> since back in the day, since, since the you day. were pregnant with Samia. Oh since gosh. you found out. I love it. Thank <laughs> you. Okay, let me grab some more numbing cream so I can get underneath. Okay, cool. Numb right now, but we're also removing this tattoo on my hand. It will take a few treatments. For How it works is the first treatment, you're not gonna see a much change at all. The first treatment's really just kind of breaking that ink up um, into kind of bigger particles um, because it's you know it's your first session. We don't want to go too aggressive to where it's gonna would burn you. So we have to go gentle the first session just to break the initial ink up. Right. Then you come back. We're gonna go stronger. It's gonna break it up even more. Your body then eats it up and um, metabolizes it and wow. takes it out of the body. You're still gonna see a difference, but like it's not gonna be like the first one's gonna be like bam gone. I'm gonna be in here every day. Right. Y'all gonna take all my money. But I'm gonna be looking cute though. Right. You're <laughs> gonna be cute though. <laughs> oh my gosh. We're doing this now? Yeah. Okay, guys, I'm about to get my um, tattoo removed. Yeah, well, we're... the process, the journey, you know? We're gonna do the first session right here. <laughs> we're gonna start here. It's not gonna be too bad though. We're just gonna put a little ice on it and make it a little more comfortable. But you said it was spi it's spicy. It's spicy, but we're gonna get through it. Here. Now put your finger like oh, that way. Okay. And then let's set your hand here. Oh, Hold my hand. Like I am holding it. Oh, okay, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> I, I didn't feel it. I'm scared. It'll be good. It's gonna be spicy. Just take. Okay. What? Like, turn time more like this. Okay. okay. For you. Um. Oh shit. I'm gonna do a test spot though. Actually, you ready? Oh. 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 Okay. 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 Okay, that's it, right? Yeah, I might want to do one more little Oh, what do you mean? That, that hurt. That's horrible. <laughs> um, it's a level 10 on the pain uh, scale. What I wasn't feeling? Yeah. Um, I sting it. It is. Okay, you want to do it again? Horrible? Uh, Terrible. All right, that's the first one now. Oh my God. But it was way darker, right? Yeah, it's like lighter. Yeah. Oh my okay. gosh, that hurt but it's worth it because I don't want reminders of that. Well we're close. <laughs> we're gonna get it gone. So right now we are applying the peel. This is the Melanex peel. Mm -hmm. oh, we call it a level two peel. Melanex peel is the name of it. Mm -hmm. um, essentially what this is um, this is going on her skin right now, and the ingredients in it are going to dissolve the outer layers of the skin, okay? Mm -hmm. And once the it dissolves the outer layers of her skin, her skin's going to make brand new skin to replace the old skin. Mm -hmm. Now, that's going to help get rid of dark spots, pigmentation, you know, some of the things that you were concerned about with your skin that you wanted to improve. Right. That's how we're going to do that. These ingredients are very powerful, very strong, mm -hmm. um, and they work really well to help with uh, hyperpigmentation, fine lines and wrinkles, texture, tone, pore size, Oh wow, and pore scar. size, oh my gosh, I have big pores. Are my exactly. pores big? They're not big, but I mean, there's definitely, we can improve them some for sure. Mm -hmm. So how this works is, um, this has ingredients in it like hydroquinone, kojic acid, arbutin, niacinamide, um, salicylic acid, and a lot of those ingredients, what they do is they go into the skin, they tell the skin to stop making that PIH, that hyperpigmentation, okay? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
And at the same time, it's working on the outside by peeling and lifting and removing the discoloration, the blemishes, the dark spots oh that you gosh. had existing. So you're gonna feel right Will now. Will it remove it the first treatment? Well, that's the thing of why this treatment is so popular is because a lot of people go to other med spas, other doctors, other dermatologists, and they try all these different things to get rid of their dark spots or their pigmentation. And they spend all this money, they're not able to. With this treatment that we're doing, people are seeing 60 to 100% improvement with one treatment, wow. you know? So people are seeing results with this that it would usually take 10 other chemical peels. So you wow. spend a year and a half and thousands of dollars to get to the results of one of these treatments. Wow. And the great thing is, is, not only is this good for all skin types, but this works especially well with darker skin types like right. Indian, Black, Hispanic. Mm -hmm. um, so it's safe for all skin types. Yeah, I've noticed that a lot of, you know, melanated girls, they come here and they live by this peel, right. you know, because it's crazy. The transformation photos I've seen on your Instagram, and I'll post some of the photos here. Yeah, you can but, post any on my Instagram for sure. Any yeah, pictures I'm you gonna want. Yeah, I'm going to post them right here. I'm like, wow. You know, I've had people that travel across the world, and they say I've went to dermatologists, been to doctors, mm -hmm. been to med spas. I've had this on my face for 15 years, mm -hmm. I've given up. Mm -hmm. And they're like, you know, and we do a treatment and it's gone. Yeah, you, you know? you're changing lives and bringing their confidence levels back up. Oh yeah, yeah. the way you feel about your face is everything, yeah. you know? Mm -hmm. If you're gonna feel confident and you feel beautiful, mm -hmm. every aspect of your life is gonna be oh, better, yeah. you know? When you're feeling secure or you feel unconfident, right. it's gonna affect everything mm -hmm. in your life. One, two, three, oh my gosh, you guys. So Paul is about to get the aftercare for me. My face is tingling a bit. The only thing that kind of hurt was the microneedling. I forgot to record that part. Hey guys, I'm home and my boo Jalen is here. Hey. Hi Jalen. How are you? I'm good. When I walked in, <laughs> he goes, um, what's that on your face? No, I, really had, I was really concerned for a second. <laughs> I was like, what is that on your face? <laughs> like I went into public like this and people just looking at me, looking <laughs> at me. It's been four hours. My face is kind of tingling right now, like in this area. It's not bad. It's bearable. I also noticed that my pimple is like surfacing. It's like pussing out. Even blackheads are popping out. Yeah, blackhead. Let me see blackhead. Hold on, wait, look. Blackhead. Right there. Hold on, wait. Oh. Let me introduce you to my <laughs> vlog. Have you been on my vlog? No. But you've been on my Instagram stories. Yes. Chef Paul. And he made me some plant-based meals. This is our second round and I'm excited to see what you so cooked up better. for me. So I'm mix, a uh, cucumbers, tomatoes, red onions, avocados, uh, a little bit of bell peppers. Oh my god! We your uh, vegan chili. Oh my god! You guys, the vegan chili is so good. Brown rice to go with that. Come say hi. You look like the guy from mom. The guy! <laughs> the guy? Yes. That's mean. Because his whole body's red. <laughs> hi, sister. Oh, you have my hunty chain. Oh, yeah, you're doing that. Oh, yeah, I've been wearing it all the time. Oh, really? You took it from my um, jewelry box? Have a vegan design. Yes. So it's a little bit, um, it's just veggies, multi spinach, a little artichoke. Um, so full wow. of pasta on there, and then you got the vegan cheese. Vegan pasta. Oh, that's why you were looking at me all like, what the heck is going on with your face? <laughs> Southwest Bowl. Love that. So this one has a little orzo pasta in it, just a tiny bit. Uh, black beans, corn, and uh, red peppers. Red peppers, uh, mangoes, and a little bit of sauce. Sweet. I love the sweetness in this dish from the mango. Right. Love. And then, and then add, you get the little sour from the miso. Exactly. Miso makes it give to that kind of sweet sour. Yeah, love it's, it. It's a little Asian. Okay. Yes, I need my daughter first to guarantee privacy. And what about the sofa that's in there right now? I would like that gone because I want my bed to be right there. So what am I going to do with the sofa? We can put it on um, Facebook Marketplace. <laughs> and sell for how much, Gil? About two hundred dollars. <laughs> okay, Mara. Okay, darling. Yes, ma'am. Oh, Lord, I, I'm so excited. It's gonna be a 
roller it's coaster a ride. Beautiful thing, beautiful. God is so good. Oh my gosh! Don't annoy me, please. Well, I promise oh, I will. I'm gonna stay in my quarters. You know what? I will stay in my quarters. Yeah, please. Because literally, I'm trying to work. I'm trying to edit. Your daughter here keeps asking me questions about chemical peel. I had to help her with her project, Vino's Bakery. We're making cake pops for her school projects. Oh, wow. That's exciting. Yes. Sorry, my sister keeps... Sister well, keeps you gotta leave me, bro. Bye. Love you guys. Love you. Okay, guys. Bye, baby. So this is what my um, face might look like. I'm watching chemical peel process videos like their journey really and so yeah. far and watch this little flat by my nose open up Ugh, it just looks so nasty but that oh, literally wow. happened on camera and i'm so glad i got it but it just literally peels like that when you start moving your face it just keeps peeling and peeling um this is 7:41 the same night i just peeled a little bit more um as you can see like my new skin is underneath is looking real good wow I've had this chemical peel on for 12 hours. It says gently wash off mask at designated time as instructed by provider with lukewarm water only. Pat dry with clean towel upon removing mask. Only apply the retinol and brightening cream. So rusted, I'm so tired. Oh my God. My face is hot. expect peeling day two three but but they also said that everyone's skin is different so you can peel the first day and that's me hey <laughs> Look at her reaction, y'all. Say hi to say hi to E from Team Two Moms. What's Everyone, good? Latoya. I know. Hold on, let me turn up this volume. Girl, my face is so itchy. It's swollen. Like it looks like it was punched in the face. I'm peeling everywhere. I feel like a snake. You know, it's gonna be all worth it at the end. How, how do you know? It, it will, it will be. I'm, I'm manifesting it, okay? We're manifesting. Have you done this? I've never, that's why I was like, call me, because I want to know what this is about. Yeah, so this is the second day, I think. Yeah, second day, and my face, it's just on, it's just itchy. It doesn't hurt, but it's itchy and it's so tight, like I can't move my face. Yeah, and you can't touch it, you can't like start peeling it away, you have to let it do its thing. Can't, yeah, exactly. But I saw some girls on YouTube because I've been binge watching these chemical peels on YouTube. And what they do is they cut the skin. Like the skin that's hanging. But girl, like when I had the mask on, I saw like blemishes and like blackheads and whiteheads surfacing. Because what the chemical peel does, it like it marinates four layers into the skin and it extracts all the impurities. Wow, so then it's worth it, it's so worth it's it. It's worth it, because I have a lot of, you know, dark spots and my skin tone is uneven, so it's yes. worth it. Oh, it's gonna be worth it, and girl, I don't know what your manager is thinking, what cocktail you make it other than about this? I know. Like, no, 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 no. 
that no yeah he's like so pissed he's like latoya you have work to do like why'd you do this peel how long is it gonna take i'm like what's well, gonna take about 25 days <laughs> <You're> so... <laughs> but it's supposed to stop peeling in two weeks like can i even work after two weeks and like put makeup on like i don't know no no don't put anything that could possibly irritate your face Exactly. Yeah. Would you go out with me though, looking like this? Yeah, with some sunglasses and a big boat hat, yes. <laughs> and a mask. If <laughs> you need anything, let me know. I need a hug. Okay, hugging. 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 Oh, hugging. <laughs> oh, hugging you, my love. Hugging you. <laughs> I, I better see you soon, huh? We were, we were supposed to meet up. Yes, I know. We gotta come or we gotta go shopping. We gotta do something together. Okay, let's do it after 25 days. After Okay. Days, okay. All right. All right, my love. Feel better. Thank you for checking up on me. Bye. I love Ebony. You know Ebony from Team Two Moms. She's so sweet, guys. Anyways, my house is a. I can't look at my face. I'm gonna turn this around. My house is a disaster. my face like i'm it's bloated <laughs> i have bloated face okay you know what this is good this is what i wanted this is what i chose to do um but i just feel like i rush into things without thinking about it first you know like i literally spoke to indy the day before i got the peel because i've been wanting a peel and she was going through her peeling process and she was telling me all the benefits and stuff and then she recommended that i go to this place in atlanta called poor star the transformation photos were unreal and I'm like, you know what? Let me just try it because this year I'm all about self-care. I want beautiful skin. You know, I'm always on camera and stuff. Mm hmm Yeah. That is so funny. Oh my gosh. So I'm on the phone with my girl, Indy, right now. Do you want to say hi? Hi, Dad. And I just realized I've been washing, not even washing, I've been doing the whole skincare routine so wrong. First of all, I haven't been washing the gentle cleanser off of my face. That's why I have so much buildup because in my mind I'm thinking, oh, is it going to wash off the chemical peel? What's for you? Oh my God. <laughs> That's why I've been white this entire time. I was so confused. I was confused because I was looking at your face and I'm looking at mine. I'm like, why is my face like this? So with the cleanser, because I literally followed exactly what she said. All she said was on day one, you're going to use the, the gentle cleanser, right? right? Then she said, where's the other one? Where, oh my God, where's the other one? Oh, here it is, on four. Okay, she said, okay, you're gonna use the gentle cleanser, right? Uh -huh. And then the retinol. Okay. Okay, then the brightening cream, right? And I use a sunscreen in the mornings. But is it gonna affect the peeling process? No. But it's peeling off. No, it's, it's not, I promise you, trust me. This is what you're supposed to do. And then once you rinse it off, you pat dry your face softly, and then you put the moisturizer on. You don't put a lot of stuff on your face. I know, it's like build up now. Oh my god. <laughs> Is it still gonna work, Indy? Yeah, it's still gonna work. When I first did the first, when I did my first one, I did the same thing. Like, I didn't wash my face <laughs> at all, but I thought the same thing. <laughs> and then she was like, oh my god, you were supposed to wash your face. I was like, oh my god. Well, I mean, they should have 
emphasize that. I was, I'm a beginner, it's my first one. She just said, use the gentle cleanser, then you're gonna use the retinol. Like, girl, you should've been like, use the gentle cleanser, and then wash it off. So my skin underneath the, um, the peel skin is looking good. Guess what I told you, that's what I'm saying, Ashley. Ashley. Wait, Latoya, you supposed to wash your face with that? See what I'm saying, bruh? I was doing it the wrong way the whole time. So first of all, they gave gave me the skincare routine, right? They told me to use the gentle cleanser, then the retinol, then the brightening cream, and all the other stuff that I have to use. After you peel. No. <laughs> <sighs> so itchy. It doesn't hurt or anything. My skin just feels really tight. And it's just... It's just itchy as hell. Oh my gosh. Okay, you guys, so this is the night of day two i'm such a fool because cleanser is for washing off <laughs> so anyways let me get up close so you can see it's looking good underneath the peel like my skin looks so smooth that's peel right there oh this is a black excellence right here yeah i rocked the fro at school today but let's get on track. Um, I ended up vlogging my sister because she's having an emotional breakdown. And I just couldn't stand it because it was traumatizing to watch. Like, huh. y'all know how we were talking about our little, um, my little project in marketing. So I'm in this class for marketing and she tells us that we have to make a food um, product and like go through the process of selling it to our like classmates and stuff. Yeah, cake pops are cute. And, but you what need a cake pop she, holder thing. Yeah. Should I get it from Amazon? Yeah. Okay. And get the sticks too. So are we doing cake pop? Yeah. Okay, guys. So we're getting a cake pop stand. Cake pops it is, guys. Cake pops. Are you sure? Yeah. So you're happy? Yes, we're so happy. Okay. <laughs> Should we build a big? No. Okay. What about an apron, though? Just please get an apron. Just please. Do you want a hat? And so with our ideas, we implemented this whole thing into these supplies, and we're gonna be making the cake pops for my project. So, Toya, she got me, um, like, these little scoopers. Let me do a little, mm -hmm, little scoopers for the, for the kick pops, holes, the balls. And then we got the kick pop sticks, okay? And the main thing that we need, uh, the kick pop stand. It's gonna make it look so magnificent, okay? And so then, obviously, we got the cake mixes, mainly vanilla and, like, some confetti stuff and white chocolate white chocolate to put it in to like dip it and then we got some gel neon gel food coloring pink purple green orange you know it's only vibrant colors going on because you know we're vibrant we're not basic around here okay um we got some shimmering sugar dust you know sprinkle on the little cake pops you know and we'll add a more sugar that's all we got right and yeah, you know, it's going to be really, like, awesome. It's going to be better than most cake pops out there. Starbucks. <laughs> um, and yeah, you know. So, guys, um, I'm going to end the vlog here. And I hope you guys are all having a nice day. Much love for me to you. Bye, hunties and hunkles. All right, Toya. Better edit this part real good. Bye-bye. <laughs>